All right, guys. Well, I got home a little bit ago, and well, I decided I was hungry, and I didn't feel like going to sleep yet. Uh, I fired up the uh, rocket stove I made a couple weeks ago. I really haven't shown it yet. Um, it's probably not going to be that great of a video, but to show you what I'm to show you what I'm going to be making. Uh, Campbell's chicken noodle soup. Simple, yet it's good for camping and whatever else you need to do. And basically, you're probably not going to get a good view with this, but we'll see if I can get a good picture out of it somehow, some way. It looks like the fire's dying a little bit. Let's put this down here. some more fire in there just to see if we can't get it a little bit hotter. And honestly this only cost about 10 bucks to make if that. It's just ducting in a 75 cent draw my guy pretzel canister I got at the, the thrift store. So shake up the Campbell's seems to be heating up pretty well being the winds blowing that way we're gonna put it over on this side gonna crack open one side of it and just put it right there and this is a test for actually when I go camping and I take this with me. Of course, when I do take this with me, it's going to be a more modified version of it. But, I mean, y you get the concept. Induction, hot air rises. So it's sucking in the cold air from the ground off the concrete through the lower duct. So it doesn't take a whole lot of wood or fuel or whatnot, or whatever you want to call it. It just goes right up the top. And... Uh, Let's see how long it takes to actually make this, and we'll, we'll get back to you when we're about halfway through. Hopefully it won't take that long, but so far we're probably about two minutes in, and I barely have didn't, did anything yet, so. Hey, guys. Well, it may not be the greatest of light that I'm coming off of right now, but hopefully you can actually see what's going on in the background. we got a good fire going. This is about... I see about four minutes in, and you know what? She's starting to heat up real nice, and she got a good flame coming out of the stack, as you can see. I'm hoping this actually comes out real well. Uh, from the bottom, you can see, you don't really see much flame at the bottom. Let me actually get the camera over here. Right, hold on. Actually move the camera. Hold on here. what she's burning on the inside and actually I mean the camera shows a lot more intensity than it should but I mean it's actually not as much as it actually really looks like don't really think it's going to be that intense because there's actually a splitter in it um, you do got to keep feeding this thing because the way it works a real shallow kind of draft and it sucks up a lot of fuel but it doesn't suck up a lot of fuels being big fuel a lot of fuel being like small sticks small twigs um, anything that laying around just basically it's just small stuff that you use for kindling this stuff sucks up and it, and it burns really 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 hot and actually let me see if you guys can actually see this That's the Campbell's soup can. And 
that's how bright and how intense that's burning. And you got a good little stream coming up the top. So, I mean, we're getting... We're getting a decent amount of heat out of this thing. And for being only... For being only 10 bucks at from, like, Lowe's or Home Depot out of, like, just tubing and ducting and a 75 cent drum you guys can build this yourself and I mean it, oh, there goes a, a log that dropped down in there and oh yeah, yeah there she goes Whew. I guess this is only about two minutes in it really, no I mean, I'm sorry about five minutes in and you know what I'm gonna have a good little snack a little bit later I'm gonna have a cigarette and I'll get back. I'm actually just gonna let it burn for a minute so you guys can actually see how well this produces the amount of heat that I, is needed to actually just cook food or just go out and have fun camp. Alright guys, it's about, it's about six, seven minutes in, and uh, well, I'm gonna, I think it's about time to pull the can of soup off and see what we have. So let me get uh, some to pour it into and a spoon and we'll see what we got. As you can see, just to get some more light, I added a little bit more fuel to it. So we're going to pull the uh, can of soup off and see what we have to eat. It's a little bit hot, so be kind of careful with it. Pour it right into the bowl. We'll open up the can a little more.
Is it soup yet? And actually, yes. Yes, it is. I don't know if you guys can actually see it. It's about 75, 80 degrees right now, and it's actually steaming. So you know what? For a $10 little cheap camping stove, here's to your health. Needs a little water to thin out the mix, but you know what? When you're camping, nothing beats chicken noodle soup and s'mores, so I don't have any s'mores, but it's a fun time. Well, guys, my, you guys saw my cheap camping stove. Makes a decent can of chicken noodle soup in about 10 minutes. So, you know what? It's not a bad deal. The amount of money you put into it, it pays for itself. Have a nice night. Stay safe. Enjoy it.